Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Tanya O'Rourke. Raise your glass because a Cincinnati company is expanding. Nine News reporter Brian Yacono is live and over the Rhine. Brian, we're talking about Samuel Adams expanding. It's worthy of a toast, of course, for that measure, but it took quite a lot of doing to even get to this point. That's right, Tanya. Good afternoon. It has been a long process and it will still be a very long process. I want to show you the active site behind me. No one's here, but there's work going on right now to environmentally clean up some of the areas around the Samuel Adams site itself. The brewery was essentially landlocked, is how city officials are referring to it. It was surrounded by old buildings and former business sites. And to expand here means first getting rid of those contaminants that were in the ground around it. Now, just 90 minutes ago this morning, Mayor Mark Mallory was joined by the head of Ohio's EPA to make this remediation effort is what it's called. In fact, the very building where they made that announcement is a site where chemicals had previously been cleaned up. The state is dropping $3.6 million into this effort in Over the Rhine. The state matching about a quarter of that total. Now, it will be another two years, Tanya. That's why we said there's still a long way to go. Two more years before we will actually see any construction for the expansion of the brewery. You know, much of the land that we have in our city it was already developed. It already had something else on it. And many times before that land can be reused, it needs to be cleaned up. And that's the express purpose of the Ohio, of the Clean Ohio Fund. Now, Tanya, we're told the biggest challenge here on this site is that there used to be a dry cleaning company here, and it worked in wholesale dry cleaning chemicals. That is what they're trying to get out of the ground and make sure it's a safe area for building and expanding for the brewery. Brewery officials, however, this morning say they expect more jobs with their expansion. Again, two years from now, but they will not give any specifics as to how many jobs we can expect. Tanya? Yeah, but it's nice to see all that work being done down there. Brian Yacono, live for us and over the Rhine. Thanks.